Uganda. Wow. Uh, when you look at the statistics, many of the children are dropping out. And some of the reasons are school fees, some of them are uniform, some you find petty petty issues. So that's why as government, uh, there is going to be a rigorous, or there is already a rigorous program of free education, whereby teachers, construction of schools, and taking care of the infrastructure in the school will be done by government. But otherwise we all need to work together to keep children in school. Uh, especially the girls. Mm. But now we are not talking about the girls alone, we talk about all children. Because if one will promote girls, then they will study. At the end, they don't have husbands. The husbands have been left what? behind, not educated. We are bringing the Arlington Secondary and Vocational School to Bududa as a quality international school that can provide the highest level of learning for our children in Eastern Region, not just Budoda, but across Eastern Region, are uh, bringing international standards of the highest level, uh, bringing the same quality of education that you can find in any school in Uganda or across East Africa, so that our kids who grow up in these mountain areas can compete for places at university anywhere in the world. The government of Uganda, which has been in the power, Qatar, Slovenia, RM, almost 40 years down the road has failed in that policy of establishing a secondary school in every sub-county. So this government should be even appreciating uh, people like the vision bearer uh, John Wanda and other private...